Well, here's a slightly unusual Jensen 70 I just picked up. This is the initial test run in my possession. It was uh, pretty dirty, hadn't been run for a long time. I did the usual cleanup and gasket replacements, stuff like that, and uh, oiled her up, and it runs pretty good. Now, what makes this unusual, at least in my eyes, is the uh, black smooth steel firebox and the boiler with the round sight glass. Typically the round sight glass you usually find with the brick faced copper clad boilers which were later. And this one uh, apparently maybe Tom ran out of material to make the copper clad brick faced firebox and had some smooth steel on hand and just whipped some up and sent them out the door. But it's not just a smooth steel firebox from another engine because it's actually made different. Over here I have a earlier uh, Model 70 and you can see the firebox is made with a uh, piece spot welded across the front beneath the boiler and an opening in the bottom. That's typically how these black fireboxes were built. This one on the other hand is made the way most of the brick faced copper clad fireboxes were made with no opening in the front. Some of the early brick faced fireboxes did have the opening like this but then he switched to a more simplified version like this. Now some other things that are a little different is the, the plated flywheel. Some of these, these later engines had plated flywheels. The, uh, of course this one here is not plated. Um, this earlier one has the UL sticker where the later one does not. The uh, safety valve on this earlier one is a little bigger diameter than the one on this later one. It's hard to tell but it is. So I thought it was pretty neat, caught my eye, so I snagged it. And uh, I thought it was interesting enough to make this video. So, hope you enjoyed the video, found it a little bit informative. And uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.